<coughs> Hello and welcome back to Skyrim. So, slight problem. Um, the conversation between the Stormcloak and his family happened while I was in the mine. So we didn't get to see that. But they basically told me, go to Whiterun and warn the Jarl that dragons are coming. City's closed with the dragons about. Official business only. I have news from Helgen about the dragon attack. Fine. But we'll be keeping an eye on you. Let's roll. Now Whiterun is our first true major city. <clears throat> it holds uh, the Jarl, of course. Um, several different shops, an inn, a tavern. And I believe... That it is also home to the companions. We'll whatever it takes, but we must have more swords for the Imperial soldiers. I just can't fill an order that size on my. Sorry, one second. Oh, why don't you swallow the stubborn pride of yours and ask Yorland Greymane for help? Huh. I'd sooner bend my knee to Ulfric's Stormcloak. Besides, Greymane would never make steel for the Legion. Have it your way. I'll take the job, but don't expect a miracle. Indeed. Yes, the companions are right over there. We'll make a quick stop with them. Take care with those nope. We'll make a quick stop with them. We'll do a little bit of their quest for now. Um, but we will stop at a certain point because there are some other quests that I need to do first before we continue down their okay, blood path. Again. I knew it. Come on now. Watch the footwork. Keep your balance. Come on. You stand a chance. I'm sure I'll curse you. Yes, I do wish to save. Thank you. That's it. That's all you've got. <laughs> Break it up. Never should have come here. Okay, yeah, that never mind. <laughs> Uh goodness. No, I don't want auto saves. I'm sure I'll save. Da, 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 da. That's the one I want. Hello, horse. Okay, whatever. If I'm not mistaken, the person I wanted to speak to is downstairs. I haven't seen your face before. I'm watching you. Hey, we match. I can't keep helping you with everything. I, you didn't help me with anything yet. brother and I, obviously. But I don't know the rest will go along quite so easily. Leave that to me. A stranger comes to our hall. Where do you stand on this war? Politics are something best avoided. I prefer more personal confrontations myself. Fair enough. Um, who are Your the companions? carries more weight than you may know, newcomer. The sort of thing some of us spend our lives pondering. The difference between a noble band of warriors and a ragged bunch of assassins is as thin as a blade's edge. I try to hold us to the right path. Why did you join the Most companions? of our band, I found this family after losing my own. I traveled the length and breadth of this land, learning all I could of the sword and the axe. I was just a boy. I had the fire of a man in my heart. 
Eventually, my body caught up to my spirit. Hmm. My predecessor, Asgar, found me in Hammerfell. I was serving as a bodyguard for some weak-necked lord out there. He brought me back here, and I realized that I was actually coming home. I worked to bring honor to this family, and to the family that I lost. For my mother, my father, and my grandfather. For all my S.H.I.E.L.D. siblings. Family and honor. That's what it means to be one of us, boy. Would you now? Here, let me have a look at you. Mm. Yes, perhaps. A certain strength of spirit. Master, you're not truly considering accepting him. I am nobody's master, Vilkas. And last I checked, we had some empty beds in your Vasker for those with a fire burning in their hearts. Apologies. But perhaps this isn't the time. I've never even heard of this outsider. Sometimes the famous come to us. Sometimes men and women come to us to seek their fame. It makes no difference. What matters is their heart. And their arm. Of course. How are you in battle, boy? I have much to learn. That's the spirit. Vilkis here will get started on that. Vilkas, take him out to the yard and see what he can do. I... Where did you go? Come back. Whoop. There we are. Go on, Vilkas. Not here. Out in the yard. Come on. said to have a look at you so let's do this just have a few swings at me so I can see your form don't worry I can take it What do you think this is? What do you think this is? We don't do bat. Oh, we don't do. We don't battle with magic. What do you think this is? You're mine. What do you think this is? What do you think this is? We don't do battle with magic around here, new blood. Now come yeah. out. You got an arrow in your what mouth there, buddy. What do you think this is? We don't do well, I may have glitched you out. What do you think? Oopsies. Sis, what do you think this is? What do you what 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 do you think this is? Not Lap. bad. There we go. Next time, not bad. Your mind oh, not bad. <laughs> Milk is no. Not that. Milk Not is no. Next time won't be so easy. Ah. You might just make it. But for now, you're still a whelp to us, new blood. So you do what we tell you. Here's my sword. Go take it up to Yorlin to have it sharpened. And be careful. It's probably worth more than you are. What brings you here? I'm guessing you're the newcomer then. Oh, don't worry too much about it. They were all whelps once. They just might not like to talk about it. And don't always just do what you're told. 
Nobody rules anybody in the Companions. Well, I'm not sure how they've managed it, but they have. No leader since Ysgrimor. Kodlak is the Harbinger, and he's a sort of advisor for the whole group. But every man is his own, every woman her own. Not actually a companion myself, but none of them know how to work a forge properly, and I'm honored to serve them. My name is Eorlin Greymane. I work the Skyforge, best steel in all of Skyrim, all of Tamriel. I have a favor to ask. I've been working on a shield for Aela. My wife is in mourning, and I need to get back to her soon. I'd be much obliged if you could take this to Aela for me. That's a good man. Alright, can I actually take these? I can. Taking all your stuff. And increasing my smoothing. Jump it! <laughs> now you're fine. <laughs> my knife in my fire. Isgrimor himself wouldn't have the patience to deal with all the rabble around here. Kodlak says not to worry about it. I worry that a bunch of snowberries are out there earning glory while we stay out of it. But I will follow the old man's lead, as ever. My mother was a companion, and her mother, and all the women in my family back to Harati Blackblade. I stayed with my father in the woods until I was old enough for my trial. We hunted everything there was to hunt. Good training. Ma didn't live long enough to see me join, but I fight to honor her and all my S.H.I.E.L.D. sisters through time. An outsider, eh? Never heard of the Companions? An order of warriors. We are brothers and sisters in honor. And we show up to solve problems if the coin is good enough. Ah, good. I've been waiting for this. Are you new here? I told you. This is the whelp that Vilkis mentioned. Ah, yes. I heard you gave him quite a thrashing. Don't let Vilkis catch you saying that. One day we Do you, you think you could handle Vilkis in a real fight? I don't think that's how the circle works. They're lording it over us all the time. <laughs> I would kill him before he drew oh, his sword. He's up there. We're rough, but there's no need to kill a shield brother over a dispute. I like your fire, though. You'll make a fierce companion. Let us hunt together sometime. Here, let's have Farkas show you where you'll be resting your head. Farkas. Farkas. Did you call me? <gasps> of course we Same did, role. Ice Brain. Show this new blood where the rest of the whelps sleep. New blood? Oh, hello. I'm Fargus. Fargus. Can I actually take her what with me as a companion straight away? Me. No. Your feet need to be quick and your eyes quicker. Skior and Ayala like to tease me, but they're good people. They challenge us to be our best. Nice to have a new face around. It gets boring here sometimes. I hope we keep you. This can be a rough life. The quarters are up here. Just pick a bed and fall in it when you're tired. Telma will keep the place clean. She always has. All right, so here you are. Looks like the others are eager to meet you. Come to me or Ayala if you're looking for work. Once you've made a bit of a name for yourself, Skior and Vilkas might have things for you to do. Good luck. 
Welcome to the Companions. You look worse than I feel. By the way, if you're looking for something to do, we've gotten a letter about someone needing some muscle right here in Whiterun Hold. I don't know what the fight is about, and that's not our business anyway. I just need you to go out there, look tough, and scare this milk drinker into submission. No more than that. I don't want to hear about a killing, understand? Try not to get carried away. You got it. Um, missions. Here we go. Hired muscle. Go do this real quick for the companions. Down and down and down. Oh, actually, it said the white run hold. How far away is this mission? Over in Riverwood? Ah, we'll just fast travel then. Not gonna make us walk all the way back over there. Hello, Mr. Khajiit. Spin. Feeling sick? You treat me maybe better, Gartry. <laughs> Real quick, before I kick your ass. He's a bard, so he says. Occasionally, he finds time to do his job here at the mill. Thinks his ballads and sonnets are going to convince Camilla Valerius to marry him, as if she would say yes. An intelligent, beautiful woman like her wouldn't fall for that nonsense. I hope. Mm, you, <laughs> you're right. When have words ever inspired feelings of I don't love? I need your jokes right now, but maybe you have a point. Maybe Camilla needs some help seeing Sven for what he is. Could you, could you give her this letter and say it's from Sven? I think I've matched that Nord's lack of cleverness perfectly. I've been sent to resolve a dispute. You can't scare me into submission. Let's go. Come on, let's see what you're made of. <laughs> Submit, Fanda. Yeah, I was supposed to say, you might want to back up, lady. Damn you. Sit. You're tougher than you look. You got me fair and square. Fine. You know what you have to do. Take care of it. Just please leave me alone. <laughs> I don't know what what you need to do, but you know what you need to do. Um. Yeah, hang on a second. Can I read the letter real quick? Yeah. Yearn to have you as my own, washing my linens and my fine blonde hair, to cook my dinner from my stove and tend to my house while I wander. Yours truly, Sven. That's a terrible letter. Tell me as soon as you've given Camilla the letter. Terrible letter. Where's Sven? No, that's the waiting button. That's not what I meant. Sven! Feindall thinks he can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling him. <sighs> what is this? The elf playing a treachery? Shocking. As if I would write this dribble. How about we play a bit of a turnabout with Feindall? Here, I had to use simple words, but this letter should convince Camilla it's from him. Mm, I don't 
Until next the need to tell you anything else right now? Where is... Oh, it's the girl who, um... Shut up, Ember. Yeah, yeah, drunk. Don't take this the wrong way, but you look a little sickly. From Feindal? What? What is? Well, you can tell that that long-eared ass not to come around the store anymore. Cool. He's not welcome. Storm cloaks and restore what we My own. This is a local favorite. Alright, no. Shh. Don't make me sing on. Like no singing. Someone that has seen far away places. Um. Now that's what I like to hear. Good work. I think you deserve some gold from my tips at the inn. Thank you. Alright then. Goodbye, son. And so we shall reconvene at the uh, companions, I believe. And, uh. Continue on from there.